do this but it's just one of those things like it might also burn on the bottom so I want something that's going to be hot evenly and I think with a Dutch oven this is probably the best way to go. You can see more videos on our YouTube if you want to check this out how to get all these beautifully diced. So we're going to do a simple braise and when we're seasoning we really want to be very liberal. We want every part of this meat to be seasoned so do not be shy. No, rub it in. Be liberal. Take your time, get this about five minutes of preheating. If you ain't sneezing, you ain't seasoning. Let's go, preheated, nice and hot. This is what we want. We're gonna do about three tablespoons of oil. Using quality, simple ingredients. For the first, I would say, minute, push your meat into the pan. You're trying to evaporate any extra moisture that's on the side of the meat, but we really want that even cooking. Seasoning, you can kind of see that there's a little bit of pepper on everything. It's not that there's a lot of pepper, but there's a little bit of pepper on everything. That's a really good sign that you're seasoning things properly. Tomato paste, super important. We cook this a little bit because if not, it's going to get really bitter. We're going to kind of squeeze it a little bit, get some of that essential oils out. Yeah. And get all of our juices out of our orange. It's starting to smell real good. Next, a couple things of butter. This butter makes everything better. And then we're going to add in our wine. Now this is super important. We're going to bring this wine up to a boil first before we add anything else. We really want to cook off some of that uh, alcohol in this. Uh, it's starting to bubble. We're going to add in our bouquet. And just think of it kind of like a tea bag. We're just going to let that herbs and everything infuse into the liquid. And then we're gonna be adding in our pound of short ribs. Meat side down, super important. We really wanna go meat side down. So we're gonna let this braise for about an hour. Once it comes up to a bowl, we're gonna bring it down to a gentle simmer and let it go for an hour. It's time for the big reveal. Actually go with just the vegetables by itself as it is right now or you can get thrown into a blender or we're gonna use a burr mixer now if you've seasoned this all the way through every time I add something it should be perfectly seasoned Raised. 